What is Juan Hanyo about? It's about a man uh, in some remote part of the Russian countryside who is irresistibly <laughs> attracted to all the local women, four women who are after him, and he cannot resist in return. He's a local school teacher. People had had great hopes of him earlier, that he was going to be a great poet, a great writer or whatever, and he hasn't quite made it. Uh, but everything is tolerable until a previous girlfriend comes back, now married, and says to him, why haven't you done better? Uh, of course, that's an awful question to be asked in life. This play is rather different from Chekhov's later plays, but it's got wonderful things in it. And it seemed to me that the most wonderful of all uh, was the, com the comedy and the farce. People sometimes forget that when Chekhov did get going as a writer, he began as a comic writer. Uh, he wrote comic stuff for years before he ever began to write anything serious. Um, and this play is full of comedy. They're real characters. And they have that great thing that really, really good characters in plays and novels have, but they just are. I mean, they've got extraordinary characteristics, but they just exist, they just live and breathe. It's set uh, in the summer, uh, a very hot, wonderful Russian summer. Uh, there's a phrase in the original that's uh, used by one of the characters who uh, says the period of the play, the month of the play, is a month smeared with wild honey. And that seemed to me to say something about, both about the heat of summer and this intense feeling that suffuses the play. Well, I would particularly love coming back to the Hampshire Theatre because I was on the board of the theatre for 20 odd years. We've got a theatre here, which seems to me to work absolutely perfectly. It's a very nice place to be in. Love having plays on here. Love just sitting in the audience and, and watching plays. It's possibly the best theatre in London.